In Creo 10.0, we have added capability within our Creo ANSYS Simulation Advanced Package to combine both structural and thermal physics into one simulation. A thermal expansion simulation would be a use case for this type of analysis. Let's do that with this simple part. First, I will constrain my geometry inside the hole. Next, I'll include thermal boundary conditions by selecting Include Thermal. I'll just select all the surfaces of this part and then apply a prescribed temperature to this model. After this is complete, I can now click on Run and wait for my results. I will get my basic results calculated by default, but I can also add some additional ones. When you see the results, you can now see the thermal expansion and what is happening with this model away from the fixed constraint. Thermal expansion provides additional advanced capabilities within CreoAnsys that our customers will use to gather important findings to help guide their designs.